What is going on guys, Willis Gaming here. In this video, we're gonna be showing you an insane game breaking glitch, which just got found out. Uh, it's pretty insane and it's probably gonna get patched very, very soon. But in this video guys, I'm giving away an exclusive emblem. If you'd like a chance to win this emblem, feel free to support the video with a like. Let's try and get a thousand likes on this video. Winner from previous videos will be in the video description down below. Um, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. Be sure to put on those bell notifications so you're notified every time I upload a video. But yeah, this is pretty nuts, guys. This is essentially a loot cave because you can do this over and over again. So what do you actually get from doing this before I actually explain uh, what it is you're doing? So you get a bunch of XP. You get essentially legendary shards from the gear you acquire. You also get obviously the gear from uh, the prophecy loot dungeon at the end, whatever your reward was you've had in previous weeks, you get that. So mine was the Akello shotgun, and I think I got a rocket launcher as well. So that will actually be in the loot pool for the stuff I can get. So if I want to farm a perfect God roll Akello shotgun, I can just do this. Each run will take you around five to 10 seconds to do. It's super quick. You also get the special material, the altered elements. So if you want to basically get Umbral Engrams as well, which has a chance from dropping from this too you can do that as well it's extremely broken guys so how do you do this so unfortunately you will need a friend i know the dreaded thing everyone hates to hear you will need a friend so if you don't have a friend head over to the discord discord.gg slash willis i'm assuming people are going to be doing this all day before it's patched because it's one of those insane things that uh, bungie are probably going to get on really really quick and patch it so here's what you need to do so basically one person will get loot and one person won't get loot now, obviously, you can rotate between friends so you can make it fair. Each person is getting loot. But here's what we do uh, to actually get this uh, special checkpoint. So you basically need to do the prophecy dungeon and get the boss super, super low. Once the boss is about to die, what you'll need to do, the person who wants to get the checkpoint needs to change character. So basically, I'm doing it from my perspective at the moment. So I'm going to be the one hosting it for my friends. So I now then basically have the checkpoint for the last room in the Prophecy Dungeon. I then basically get my friends to join my game. I start it and then as soon as the ships go into the sort of slipstream thing, you basically need to just change characters. This is so you don't lose the checkpoint. Now the people who are actually still loading into the checkpoint will get the loot along with the chest, uh, the altered element, umbral engrams, the loot from the chest obviously and just a bunch of XP for your season pass. Once again, this is extremely broken and is probably going to be patched very, very quick as it gives you a lot of stuff which, yeah, yeah way too quick. Also, this also counts on dungeon report. So if you're looking for just fast clears on your dungeon report and you just wanna beef it out like a cheese ball, then uh, unfortunately this will count for your dungeon pass and you will get uh, those green dots on your dungeon pass, which is pretty funny but i'm gonna leave you guys some gameplay of us actually doing this with both perspectives so you can kind of see uh how it works and basically what you need to do so once again explaining how to get the checkpoint you don't need to do this every time so don't worry you basically just need to do a prophecy get the boss super super low and when he is about to die and when he dies you need to change character yes change character as soon as he dies this will give you this special checkpoint that you can host for your friends but yeah i'll leave you guys with some gameplay hope you guys enjoyed be sure to leave a like subscribe if you're new and if you need friends to do this jump in the discord discord.gg slash willis this has been willis gaming and peace another mess like this and I'll push you through an airlock
sacrificing both light and dark to fight the Guardian. Drector, what have you done, you insufferable rat man? Hey, our mutual friend had a question. We all did. So we asked the Nine. It was the answer. Isn't it obvious? Light and dark are means to survival. It's not about saints or sinners. The Vanguard wouldn't abide that answer. Vanguard ain't here. I'm sick of their dogma. What do you think, Chosen One? Come on back, and I'll get you paid. Some bloodlust, hero. It hit me when you were tearing that last pack of Taken apart. What the Nine are trying to say. Light, dark, it don't matter. Light and dark are not the same. Didn't say the same, just friends don't matter. Say that clearly the nine pass no judgment on dark or light, and they love passing judgment. Trust that means in their eyes, the two of the Zavala would disagree. have spoken. Their answer is complete. Then we learn nothing. Well, I wouldn't say that. Clearly, the Nine pass no judgment on dark or light. And they love passing judgment. Trust. That means in their eyes, the two are the same. Zavala would disagree. <laughs> 